Hey what's up, this is Ian from Bauman Music and today I'm gonna show you a very very simple way how to extend background music within your video editing software just by finding loops and repeating them. In this case I'm using Adobe Premiere but you can also do all these steps in any other video editing software as Avid Media Composer or Final Cut Pro. All that you should be able to do is that you can cut, that you know how to trim and that you know how to copy and paste. That's all we need. As you can see here, we've got a typical scenario on the video one track. There is a corporate video presentation with some text and slices and stuff like this and on this uh, audio one track we've got a background music but this song is a bit too short and does not cover the whole video project and so we need to extend it and to do that i typically start listening to the song and slice it very loosely you will just understand what i mean uh, as i do it so let's go Okay, so we could call this the uh, intro of the song. And then you will realize a guitar coming in at this point. So I can set very loosely a cutting point right here and continue listening. Okay, as you've heard here at this position the drum set changes. I'm gonna set a very loose cut right here and continue listening. Also some uh, strings have come in to the zone. And yeah, maybe you've uh, recognized that um, on this position another synthesizer has come in. I can also set a cut right there. Okay, now to make loops out of these slices we need to set those points very accurate and I'm going to zoom in a bit and then I counting the beats like a kind of dancing structure may seem a bit uh, silly in the first moment but believe me it works very well i just gonna show you uh, how it works four one two three four one two three four one two three four one and exactly on number one i'm gonna hit the pause button and then zoom in and now i can already see okay I'm here straight in front of a kind of drum element, so I'm gonna correct this cutting point on this frame and zoom out again, go to the next point. A little bit more uh, for play. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and stop exactly on the uh, one as you can see here we could um, move this point one frame to the right zoom out again and continue to the next point three four one two three four stop zoom in and as you can see I'm right here in front of another drum or whatever so I move this cutting point exactly on this frame straight in front of this event zoom out again and that's already it now I can just take this apart and take any of those loops and copy and paste and then attach it directly 
and as you will hear there is uh, no transition that you can hear. So I've already extended my zone by duplicating this loop. Um, I'm gonna move this stuff a bit to the right and also duplicate this loop right here in front. Put all the slices together and now as you see my music is long enough. I have duplicated this loop one time and I've duplicated this loop one time and as you can hear there is no transition seems like this song has even been produced like this um, finally to avoid any cracker or any noise or any distortion I recommend you to place a very very short audio crossfade on this transition I just take it here from the FX library, put it on the transition, zoom in and give it a very very tight timing a bit more to the left so the crossfade has finished when it comes to this point and you will not even hear anything but this is a very good way to ensure that you will not have any peaks or over distortions on this transition. That's already it, not a big deal. If you like the song that I used here, you can get it on Audio Jungle for your own media projects. And also this uh, video presentation by Labs Castle that you can see in the project is available as a After Effects template on Video Hive. I will provide a link to both items in the video description. And so I hope you like this short tutorial. If you do, feel free to share it and don't forget to subscribe for my channel. Have a great time and see you next time.